What is going on everybody? It's a beautiful day today here at the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida. And today we found Newell Coach 1637. This is a 2019 quad slide P50 that is absolutely in the wrapper. This is a bath and a half coach and an amazing spec that I'm really excited to show you today. There's all kinds of cool stuff going on with this paint job. You've got different metallics and different patterns and some of the patterns you don't see from 20 or 30 feet away but when you get up close you can see drop shadows different fades a lot of cool stuff going on in this coach and very rich colors a very masculine paint job I really like the look of this coach so the front end of this coach is a look unlike any other motor coach on the road you've got the European style mirrors this is a Porsche designed exterior so these front and rear caps are all designed by Porsche design the side walls of this coach are aluminum. The Newell coach structure is unlike any other motor home out there. And if you ever get a chance to take a factory tour of the factory in Miami, Oklahoma, definitely worth checking it out. Newell coach is a class act operation. I look forward to showing you guys inside, but I want to show you these executive steps. You don't see the motorhome budge at all. It's such a robust machine. This has a gross vehicle weight over 60,000 pounds, and it's just a really industrial build. You're gonna see that as we go through the coach. It's got chrome wheels, Michelin tires with date codes of 2021. We'll open these bays up. It's got the electric bifolding basement doors. We've talked about that in other videos. You'll really feel the quality when we open and close these bay doors. Coming up to bay one here, we've got a full pass-through bay with the slide tray that does have this remote. There's a lot of redundancy built into this coach. If for some reason the remote batteries die, there is a second switch right here. It's all lined with carpet and you can tell that this coach is in the wrapper. You've got your Newell Coach Zip D lawn chairs. This is a very high-end lawn chair extremely comfortable then you've got that Newell coach logo embroidered in the lawn chair that's part of camping right you're gonna need somewhere to uh, have a seat outside so I like that they're thinking ahead for that bay 2 is gonna be another full pass through bay with this deep bin that is on a power slide tray again is powered by the remote it's got that turned aluminum look on the face stainless steel lip looks like there's some extra carpets probably for the cockpit area but a lot of storage here and this makes loading and unloading very easy with these big bins and with this taller profile that'll help hold your stuff in place so it's not sliding around inside of the bay there. The next bay is going to be your electronics bay. It does have this bin that's on a slide tray and this will easily come out. It's got those two pegs on the bottom that will fit right here but if a technician does need to work on stuff in here this is set up to carry up to 300 pounds and then you can easily slide back in here, access all of your fuses, your breakers, your components. They're definitely thinking ahead and it's well lit, I'll point out. Lots of lighting as we go through this coach. And then you've got this little storage bin just to utilize that space. And that just pops back in on that tray and we'll go out again, a stainless steel lip here, stainless steel lips around these bays. This does have a exterior TV here. This TV is on a swivel. And then behind that is gonna be your Aquahot 675 5D as well as your holding tanks. This next bay is going to be your fuel bay. You can fill up your 200 gallon diesel fuel tank on both sides of the coach. It's got a little camera here so that when you're aligning up with the diesel pump you can see exactly where that's at making life a little bit easier and then this is locked in the bays as well to protect that diesel fuel and you've got that beautiful stainless steel finish and then your house battery bank here. All in excellent 
excellent condition. And as we go through this paint, the, the shadows are kind of weird right now, but you're gonna see metallics here, different shades of metallics, a cool little pattern. You'll see this drop shadow and this thick white pinstripe. A lot of cool stuff going on in this paint job. This does have the active steer tag axle. We got some cool shots of this coach rolling around the parking lot here, and you can see this tag axle actively steers to help this coach really pivot. I believe this is the tightest turning radius for a 45 foot class A motor coach in the industry. Here's a side look at the engine bay. This has the Cummins X15, 605 horsepower. You've got your 8D Lifeline batteries. I love how Newell Coach finishes everything out. Everything is super clean here in this engine bay. And then coming around the back of the coach, I love this styling. They brought the paint scheme through the back of this coach. You can see that drop shadow, a lot of cool stuff going on, a lot of detailed paint work coming through this grill. And then you can see that Cummins X15 back there. Just a really sleek style with the Porsche designed exterior rear cap here. And here's a look at that monster Cummins engine. You have an air hose right here. It does have an air doubler if you want to pump up your tires. You do have your easy access to your fuel filter, easy access to all of your belts. It's super clean. Then you've got a 25,000 pound towing capacity. You're gonna see a lot of these Newell coaches towing stacker trailers, leading towing capacity in the class A industry. Beautiful door here for your side radiator. Again, that paint scheme comes through the radiator door there. It's a little compartment for your 50 amp. It does have a little remote that you can walk with your 50 amp cord as you're putting that in and out. You can also start and stop your generator in this bay as well as turn your batteries on and off. And I always love to point out just how flush these slide rooms are as well as the windows. These are valid slides with air seals. And then these windows are cut into that aluminum sidewall. So it's totally flush and that really takes a lot of skill to be able to do that. If you look at other motorhomes out there, most of the high-end motorhomes are gonna have like a frameless window that's just on top of the body. So you can see that little lip when you look down the side of this. This does have the big window awnings over the windows. So when you look down the side of the coach, the window awnings are the only thing that are kind of protrude off the surface there. Here's the other side of that diesel fuel bay. Again, a camera on this side as well, finished in stainless. And then you do have your DEF tank. And here's a look at the plumbing bay. This is gonna house your 143 gallon fresh water and 143 gallon gray black combined waste holding tank. You've got a little spot to wash your hands out here. This is your sewer hose. I like that this has this little knife valve here. So you have a little redundancy built in, in case you accidentally dump your waste. You're not gonna dump it until you manually open this valve at the sewer dump. This does have a manifold system. In case you have a leak somewhere, you can turn off that one area of the coach and then still use your water in the other areas of the coach. You have fresh water fill on both sides. And here's a look at the Mach 5 Headhunter water pump, as well as an auxiliary SureFlow water pump. You've got your tank level monitor outside here. And again, everything is super clean inside of this coach. It does have tank heaters for colder weather. This bay is gonna be your cooling system for the generator. It's got that 20 kW generator that does create a lot of heat. So they've got this system just to cool that off. And then here's the other side of those full pass through bays. And we have the bins out on both sides. So you can actually see the inner workings here of the slide tray. It's on a chain here. Looks like aluminum framing, very clean, very well built. And then those bins will come out on both sides of the coach. And then the first bay on your driver's side is gonna house your twin air compressors as well as your windshield wiper reservoir. The generator door will open that up. And then it's got this quiet box. We'll keep that noise down when it's running. You can see this is on airbags, super clean. It does have a fire suppression system and that will generate a lot of power to run those four rooftop 15,000 BTU AC units. Let's go take a look inside. I'm excited to show you guys this one. 
Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Newell Coach 1637. Now, the first thing I wanna point out in this coach is how big this driver side slide is here in the salon and galley. Because this slide is so large, it does need that extra bearing to support all of that weight, and that's what this structure is here as well. But the cool thing about that is, is you have a lot of space in this salon. I mean, this does not feel like we're in a motor home right now. So, and this is a great floor plan. Up front here, you've got this lounge chair, and I'm gonna try this out for you guys. It's extremely comfortable, as you would expect. But you can also utilize this space here as like a work area. You do have outlets and USB ports that do pop out of the counter. They do have some cool decor pieces there. This does have a file cabinet drawer, a couple of those, and then you've got a little spot you could put like a printer, you could put a monitor or something back there, and then there's a little spot here to run cords down through that countertop if you need. This is a beautiful countertop here, a solid surface countertop, and I love the neutral, natural colors in this coach. A lot of earth tones, a lot of different colors that really come together well. This does have a sleeper sofa with this ottoman that does have a little spot that can be used as a, like a coffee table, and then if we wanna take that off, this can be utilized for storage. You can see super clean. That carpet looks like it hasn't had much in there, and then if you wanna use it as a footrest or set a couple glasses there, that's easy to do. And then you can slide it down and put it wherever you need. And then this does have the pull out sofa if you do have guests. Now I wanna point out how large this Newell coach window is and then how tall it is as well. So not only is this slide room huge, but it's very tall. You have a lot of height here in the middle of the coach as well. But when we look closely here at the ceilings and all the edges, how Newell coach finishes everything out no detail gets unfinished i love the sconce lighting then they've got a little wine glass and cocktail glass cabinet here utilizing this little space above the slide room bearings and then this is a cool little piece here that will hold those cocktail glasses in place while they're going down the road so that you don't get any rattles from that cabinet. Now coming across the coach here, I love this floor plan with the booth over here. And this is a very large booth. Usually this is gonna be your patio side with your view. So a really nice placement for this. You've got USB ports and outlets kind of hidden behind this decor piece here. Back across to the galley, you're gonna see that same surface countertop like we saw in the booth just to switch it up a little bit more and then a really cool backsplash you do have a two-tone wood grain with the two different colors everything really ties together well huge sink your wolf induction cooktop and a lot of storage in this coach this is going to be all lined with carpet all in the wrapper, your GE convection microwave. And then you've got this big panel here that you can control your shades, your lighting, your generator, your climate control, your slide rooms. You've got theater mode, all kinds of cool stuff that you can do from this panel. And then here in the same slide, you've got a huge pantry here. It's very well lit. As soon as I open that up, you can see there's lighting here that glow in. You can see all the way to the back of the cabinet. It's all lined with carpet with that beautiful wood grain face. A couple of the Newell Coach goodies here, but a lot of storage here in your pantry. Big deep drawer space as well. And then all kinds of storage here, a little spot for your trash receptacle. Big deep drawers. You also have a garbage disposal here. Again, all lined with carpet. And then your Fisher Pickel dishwasher, nice deep silverware drawer, lots of drawer space in this coach. I wanna point out this beautiful ceiling, beautiful colors. You have almost a cream color. I don't know if cream's the right color to describe it, but then almost a barnwood style, uh, two different tones with these large uh, rectangular panels with the puck lighting, uh, and then these beautiful surfaces on your slide room faces, just some very high-end textures that really draw everything together well and really gives it a nice feel inside of this coach. Across from that huge pantry, you've got your refrigerator, and this is all finished out with that same style cabinetry, so it kind of blends in with the rest of the cabinet. It's a GE monogram refrigerator, pull out ice tray, as well as a deep freezer, more pantry space here. Again, just utilizing all of that storage. And because you have so much headroom here, that's gonna give you more height for storage. So you're gonna have taller storage in this coach as well. 
lots of spaces to put stuff. Again, just more storage here in the hallway, big deep pantries your washer and dryer and I like that when we brought these doors out you can slide those back in they also give you a little spot up here for laundry detergent and this is all super clean finished out you know, even inside of these cabinets you know Newell coaches are extremely high-end but it's a bath and a half coach here so we'll just press this button for our bathroom door it's got the pocket air door really nice style inside of the half bathroom I love the veneer that they use you do have a vent with a fan plenty of room in here beautiful tile work that goes up the wall, different textures, nice window to bring in some natural light, and a totally different countertop too. I've seen three different countertops in this coach so far, but everything really ties together well. I'll end the wrapper too when we open this up. Even with this huge salon area, there's still a lot of coach left to see, so we just press one button. Let's take a look at the back of the coach here. So a huge master bedroom. We do have the blinds open in here right now. You can see that huge window does have the Gallo acoustic speakers, another big window behind your bed, more Gallo acoustic speakers. I love these leather panels that they use for the wall panels. You do have a lot of mirrors in this coach as well. And this does have a TV on a televator, so you're gonna lose a little bit of storage here, but you do have storage here in the corners. Good amount of countertop space here, bedside, as well as some wardrobe hanging space. And then again, this little countertop space that you see here, this is gonna be the bearing for that slide room. You know, these slide rooms are so robust that they need that area to put those components to hold all of that weight. And you can see those same beautiful ceilings and beautiful textures that we saw in the salon continue into the bedroom. This has got a huge rear bath, really nice flow of this coach. Again, continuing the two-tone cabinets, huge corner sink, and this is cool. They've introduced a fourth solid surface countertop that we've seen in this coach. This is that same surface we saw in the half bath, really blends together. I like the two-tone countertops and then the darker cabinets back here in the bathroom, really cool finish. And the Newell Coach does lots of stuff, like these mirrors, when you're getting ready, these mirrors will kind of adjust in so that you can see all around you. You've got a mirror behind you, mirrors from all angles. And then you do have a little spot for dirty laundry here, nice big, deep laundry hamper. You could load up a lot of dirty clothes in there. If if you want to procrastinate on laundry and then more storage here this is going to be a big cedar closet you can smell how fresh that cedar is and then nice drawer space here big deep drawers and you can really feel that newell coach quality when you open and close these another large closet here again cedar closet you can see Newell Coach 1637 owner's manuals. Here's an extra leaf uh, for your dinette table, fire extinguisher and glass breaker. And plenty of room around your toilet. Super clean storage here above your head. Different tile work here in the bathroom on the backsplash. And the tile floors in the bathroom are a little bit different from the rest of the coach, giving it a nice feel. And then I'll do the shower test for you guys. It is a little step up into the shower. So you lose a little bit of headroom, but still plenty of headroom in this coach. Plenty of room to pivot around. And you can see the shower head is plenty high for me. And a beautiful glass enclosure here as well. Really a nice feeling. If you are a serious and qualified buyer, this coach is available here at the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida for $1,655,555. And you can expect to receive a completely different buying experience than what you would get at the big box stores. When you purchase this coach, they will go over the coach with you, explain how to use all of the systems, make sure everything works, you can camp the night here, Make sure you understand how to operate everything. The Motor Coach Store is a top-notch operation. Everything from the detail process to the PDI process, delivery process, the way they do their websites, photograph, filming, all the way around. And when you purchase a coach here at the Motor Coach Store, they like to say you become a part of the Motor Coach Store family. If you are ready to become the next owner of this coach, you can contact Bradley Twait. His information is available at themotorcoachstore.com. I greatly appreciate all of you that are subscribing to the channel and liking these videos. I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again.
Ooh.